Thank you very much. ACDP. Thank you, Chairperson. Chairperson, this is a report about the GCIS and the MMDA. Um, one could say this is government spin doctors. And according to the report, the department's outreach programs and activities in the words of the report, allow the department to interact with communities and often provide an early warning for any societal issues or discontent. So what happened with last year's July riots? Why was there no early warning system? Why were mixed messages shared by different ministers and President Ramaphosa? And obviously there was a lapse there by GCIS. What is interesting is that the report states on the contrary that the GCIS during the unfortunate July 2021 unrest, government messaging was ramped up to restore a sense of calm and demonstrate a responsive government that handled the situation and responded to the people's needs. If only, President Ramaphosa himself three, said three weeks have passed since the country experienced an orchestrated campaign and our security services were found wanting. The expert panel said referred to violence never seen before contestations in public space, including between senior members of government and a sense of uncertainty and vulnerability amongst the citizens, anything but a sense of calm. Let's also have a look at the report relating to the 2021 local government elections, where it says as a result of educating and informing people, millions of South Africans turned up to voting stations. Yes, they did. But remember, only 12 million people out of a possible 26 million people registered to vote, voted. Again, a lapse. So, Chairperson, I realize time is very limited. There are problems with the regression in terms of the audit with both the GCIS and the MDDA, and regrettably, the ACDP will not support this report. I thank you. Thank you, Honorable Member.